your senior high school. Today I'm going to show you how to log into your Chromebook and I'm also going to give you a tip and a trick in case the Chromebook won't turn on, not necessarily mean it's broken. I'm going to show you how to fix it. Okay, so this is your Chromebook. You may have a different version, a newer version. This is an older one. You have all of the different ports right here. You shouldn't be using these this much. Here's a USB in case you want to plug in an external mouse. There is a HDMI port. This is for your headphones. Over here is more USB and your power cord. Now, generally, when you open it, it'll come on by itself. Let's see if it does. Yes, it'll come on by itself. Sometimes it won't, and you may have to push your power button here. Now, there is an issue sometimes when you are uh, uh, trying to open it up to where the power button won't work, nor will it open up, uh, never will it come on when you open it up. I'm gonna show you that. All right, so your sign-in screen will be right here. Uh, it'll ask you to connect to a Wi-Fi network if, uh, you have a Wi-Fi network available, of course. Once you connect to it, if you hit remember, it will automatically connect. Now, one of two things will happen. One, you can hit next and a camera will pop up. Hey, look, there I am. Woo -woo. All right, and you can hold up a badge, etc. but you don't necessarily have to do that. So you can go right here to sign in with a different account. All right, so I'm gonna log in to my account, josh.beavers. Now, your child should already have a login uh, from when, from, from last year, but of course, if they, they probably don't remember it, or if they're a new student or whatever, they won't have one. That'll all be provided to you. So you say you know it. You hit next, then you put in your password, Let's see if that worked. I'm working with one hand here. Nope, I messed it up. All right, hooray. It's going to work. Wait. So, you got to log in, and here is everything. It'll pop up at the bottom of the screen, or your Chrome is there, and then other things are gonna pop up, et cetera. Now, uh, I'm connected to Webster Parish School Board. The Wi-Fi signal here is kind of weak. But down here at the bottom, this, is, this shows your battery charge. Mine is connected right now, and it says that I am 81% uh, full. It's connected, charging. It's important to connect these things every day. The battery dies pretty fast, but it also charges pretty fast. So if you're on the hybrid uh, model and you're coming to school every day, uh, or you come to school every other day, it may be uh, an issue to where you forget. So you need to make sure you plug this thing up when you before you come to school. You don't want it dying in the middle of the class. All right, so right here, you can control your volume. Here are your settings, things you might do. Night light off, it'll change all kinds of things like that. You can connect to Bluetooth and other things of this nature. So I'm signed in. Uh, I can sign out, or you wanna turn the thing off, power, etc. cetera. Now I'm gonna turn it off, because I'm gonna show you that issue I was talking about. Let's pause here. Okay, let's say for example, you have your Chromebook, and when you open up the lid, it doesn't come on. When you hit the power button, it doesn't come on. That doesn't mean it's broken. One of the biggest things I've seen students uh, encounter this and they just bring it to me and they think it's broken. It's not. It might be, but chances are it's not. Chances are it's just got a little hiccup in here and there's a way to get around it very simply. All right, so let's say you open up your lid and the Chromebook won't come on. Let's say you push the power button, the Chromebook won't come on. Well, first thing is consider the power, um, the battery may be dead. So plug the power source up, okay? And then try again. If it still doesn't work after the power source is plugged up and after the you've hit the power button, then it's not necessarily broken. All that you need to do is right here, this little button right here. It's like a little refresh button, the circle with the arrow. So what you need to do is, and I can't show you because I've only got the one hand, is you need to hold this button 
and the power button down at the same time. So hold this button and the power button down at the same time. That'll kind of clear it out. Hold it down for 10 seconds, okay? It might come on at the end of those 10 seconds by itself. If not, then take your hand up, then hold down the power button again, and it should come on. Don't automatically assume that it's broken just because it won't come on. So remember your school is gonna be giving you your login information in case your child doesn't already have it. Also, follow that trick in case the Chromebook doesn't come on. Doesn't necessarily mean it's broken. Again, my name is Josh Beavers. I teach at Lakeside Junior Senior High School. We look forward to seeing your child this fall.